Oh, I didn't mean to. Oh, shoot. Well, uh, oh, hello, everyone. Welcome back to Valencia 2. <laughs> that was my friend. I didn't mean to smack him with my shovel. Oh, no. We're going to need a, another a guy there. But uh, anyways, guys, welcome to Valencia 2. Today we got some some stuff, uh, some fun stuff planned. We're going to be getting into some reactors from Power. Um, so if we go here to their manual... <laughs> Give me I can't believe I killed him. Like I didn't mean to kill the snowman. Oh no, poor poor guy. Okay, so we need to go ahead and make the reactors. As you can see from power, we have a whole lot of items here that are pretty neat. But the reactors is what we want. I went ahead and do a, a creative world and was testing these out. These are actually really cool. They're extremely easy to build, believe it or not. So we're only gonna need to craft up a total of nine. So these things are actually really cool. Um, we're going to be just doing the basic one because we can get 5,000 FE per tick out of here, which is pretty much all we need. And for the amount of uranite that we have, it's like the perfect amount. And if we make any more, I'm pro we're probably going to run out. So we need to go ahead and make up a total of nine of these. Now, I do have enough uranite for this. Uh, but basic. So what we need to do is make up some of these capacitators. That's a lot. Maybe more than we should have made. Okay, so we need four of these to make four. So we need a total of 36 of these. Sh sure. Okay. I don't even know what just happened, but we got all 36 of these, which is fine. Uh, so let's see about going ahead. All we need is these. Let's go ahead here. We need to make a bunch of these up. Perfect. I know I saved you for a reason. Okay, so what oh, we also need, I didn't make a mistake. Just kidding. You can just convert it over. Cool. So, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, eight. 32. Okay, so we just need to make one more. What are we missing? We're just missing one of those. All right, so we got the total of the 36. Now, check this out. This is pretty cool. Okay, so we seem to be putting all of our power stuff back here. So I'm going to just kind of put this back here with it. But if we go ahead... And do this, so I just, I just, I have with all 36 of my inventory, I just click. Ta-da, we did it! Yes, yes we did. It's beautiful. It's amazing. So pretty precious. Okay, so what we're going to need is we're going to need some redstone here. I already got a little bit of coal on I me. Mean, we're going to need coal. Um... Actually, gonna grab just a little bit more. This is a block of coal. We need some snow on us, which is good. We got enough here. We need the uranite. Perfect. So let's go ahead up here. Oh, we also need a water bucket. We need the water. Here we go. And don't mind my backyard. We just have a reactor back there. So we put this in there. Okay, as you can see, this filled up this coolant reservoir over here. If you, if you don't put a bucket in here, it just does that. We're gonna put our snow blocks over here. This will give us minus three degrees Celsius, which is also good. We're gonna go ahead and put some coal up in here because this gives us more efficiency, uh, but it does increase the temperature a bit. And then if we put redstone in here, as you can see, this is more production, more fuel consumption, and adds 100, uh, 120 degrees Celsius. But if we chuck this in here, guys, we're cooking. And so this is already sitting at 60 degrees Celsius. Throw this in here, and as you can see, we are making power. Oh, we're currently at five point. Ooh. Okay, so it should settle down around five k per uh, per tick. Yeah, five point five. So not bad. As you can see on the right over there, um, it says stored. That's going through our power. That's a that's an okay speed. But I mean, we're we're producing power. We got to get our system hooked up to this right away. Okay, so I just realized that these pipes aren't actually going to cut it anymore. Uh, yeah, this water source is going to have to go for a meow. Oh, you got to pull it out the front. Okay. Oh, are we really short by one? Oh, man. I mean, we're going to have to upgrade that, like, right away. Um... Okay, so we can turn that off on and off, which is awesome. Okay, but I do need some iron. That will have to do. 
chainmail chest plate. That's pretty neat. All right, so we got 12 iron. So how do we upgrade these cables? So these transfer 5.12. And we just need a bunch of them around an infused alloy. That's it? That is amazing. We're going to have to make up a bunch of... I'm going to have to get a whole bunch of iron going. And I'll have to convert all of these pipes off camera. But I wonder if you can take out from more than one side. Okay, we got that the remaining remainder of the pipers made. Look at that, we have four million RF stored here. We got three point two million RF stored here. Perfect. And then last episode oh, we did that's not the right block. Last episode we got all of the slime guys for the cactus, right? Because if we come back oh wait a second, I didn't link those. Okay, so if I chuck these cacti in here, yeah, we got more slime. Where did that? Oh, that's where the cactus went. Okay, perfect. So we got more slime, and if you guys remember, remember, if you guys remember, we needed the slime to get into refined storage and to make the binder, the processor binding right here. So we need two string and one slime to do so. Now, what is the best way to get string, you may ask? Well, I asked the same question, and we're going to figure this out together. So we can get industrial hemp fiber together to do it. Um, cattail seeds. Okay, so we can make it, which isn't a bad idea. Um, we can kill mobs. And kill a cat for it. That's sad. Cave spider, spider. Uh, dungeon chests have it. So you can throw wool into there. Okay. So a sheep farm probably wouldn't be a bad idea. Yeah, because we can throw it. Ooh, we can even throw it into here, so we don't need to require power or that. Um, pretty much just the same thing. Okay. So a sheep farm with automatic stuff dumping it into here would be an amazing idea. We can get all the string we wanted. Okay, so let's see what we can do after with that idea. You know, guys, I was thinking that maybe we should go ahead and get a builder going from RF Tools. We do have the power to support this now, and this honestly isn't all that bad. We just need a quarry card. Uh, this one here, this is a, this is a dirt one. Uh, just a diamond here, or three diamonds here, one diamond here, so four diamonds. A few irons. So I probably I will need to find one more piece of iron, but uh, let's go ahead and make this. Uh, I think this will be uh, like amazing for us to get right now. So we're gonna need some bricks here. We got all the bricks we need. Perfect. Uh, if we go here to a builder, like so. Hit a. What do we need? We need some redstone. We need. The middle guy, and then for this, we just need blue dye and two gold nuggets. Perfect. Let's see here. Okay, we can make the machine frame just like so. Now we just need the redstone. Man, boom, like that, we have a builder. Perfect. Okay, let's go ahead and get this in here. Um, and then for that, we're gonna need the quarry card here. This requires one iron. Yes, yeah, so we're gonna need to find a little bit more iron. Okay, so we should have enough iron now to finish up the quarry card here. Let's go ahead. Okay, so we're going to need paper, redstone, and all of the shenanigans we can manage. Okay, so I believe there were needed some bricks in there. Where'd you go? Okay, so we do need... More than just two. I'm oh, sorry, yeah, we need that many. Okay, shape card, perfect. Now to make this one, we need two more redstone and a pickaxe. Okay. There we go. Shape card, quarry. Okay, so let's go ahead and get this moved over we're gonna need a chest of some sort to gather all of our materials let's go ahead and upgrade this guy 
to a diamond chest. So we're going to put an iron chest in here. We're going to go around it with gold. And then we're going to grab two diamonds. We're going to grab a bunch of glass. Like six glass. So we got three here. Okay, there we go. All right, diamond chest. This will hold all the items that will be coming out. Okay, so we are just going to put this guy right here. Going to connect that there. So this thing's got a whole heck ton of power. We're going to have to turn this guy back on while we're running this. If we put this up here, should be good. Now we're going to void stone, cobblestone, dirt, gravel, netherrack, and stone. We will take some sand here, which won't be a bad idea. But let's see here. 500 by 500 by, we will say, we're on line level 63. Yep. Okay, so we'll throw that in here. We're going to preview it before we start it. Okay, so that is how high it will be. So it will mine all of our base. We don't want that yet. If we uncheck this, it will undo that. Yep, there it goes. Okay, so now we need to worry about the offset. Oh, I think that just crashed the game. Okay, I think we're good now. Let's go ahead and remove the card this time. We're going to offset it by about negative 50. Uh, let's, I'd rather see it than not. So we're going to do negative 30 here. Uh, we don't want this hollow. We want this solid. going to install it here. We're going to run this here. Okay. Whoa. Trippy. It lets you see underground. Okay, so that's where it is. Um, yeah, so we need to go down just about two more blocks, two to three more blocks. We're going to undo that so it undoes all of that, pull this back out. And then I'm going to go down actually another five just to be safe. And we're going to do the supported view again. So we should really see it over here, what level it's at on this. Yeah, so this way it won't it won't destroy any of our stuff. You're dead. It won't destroy any of our stuff here, but we can still get that working. Now all we need to do is get a lever. Oh look at this. We have a guest who wants to come check us check out the uh, the starting of our thing. Okay, we're gonna undo that. I'm gonna be a too You're too loud. You have to go. You have to go, I'm sorry. Okay, flip the speech, and it's on. Okay, so it's draining all this power here. Let's have a look. Can we limit how much power we're using? I don't think so. So it means we're probably going to be using all of the power we could possibly get. Holy heck, I did not think about the slate and all the other rock. Oof. We are getting a lot of iron, though. That's what we wanted, right? This is what we, we bargained for. Or even getting some raw uranium, uranite. I keep calling it uranium. Okay, yeah, we're going to start to run out of power here. I just can't keep up, unfortunately. Not enough power. Yeah, we're even getting redstone. Perfect, look at that. So we're already almost at enough for some iron. If I do this, I think it'll only allow iron in. Or is this top? It's not enough room. No usable storage top or below. Okay. So yeah, we need to go ahead and flip this back off here. This will start to charge back up. As you can see, we are generating 5.7 RF per tick, which is beautiful for this early in the game. But yeah, um, so I mean, we got we got some iron. We got 51 iron in just a few seconds. Now I will need to find a way to void those, and I think the best way to do that will be with some pipes. Maybe we'll just like toss them or something. I don't know how we're gonna get around that. I'll have to look into it. But look, there's 51 extra iron. Beautiful. Actually, we're not gonna wait for it. We're gonna we're gonna swap it out. 
Perfect. Okay, I want to see something here. Now we're going to go ahead and try to see if we can filter this out. Now there is an item called a trash can here that we might be able to filter uh, some of the items going into there. Yes, we can. Perfect. Let's go ahead and make one of those. We should have really made one before we started this. Actually, I believe if we put... Um, Let's get everything out that we want to filter. So some of this, 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 a dark stone, basalt. Okay, and we will throw this here. We can filter those. Oh, this isn't fast at all. Oh, we need an auto trash can. That requires some redstone. Okay, now that we have the auto trash can rock and roll, what we can do is just go ahead here and set up the same filters for that. Okay, we are fresh out of diamonds, unfortunately, so we're going to have to be careful. Got another one of these export buses. We put all these filters back on. Actually, we're going to need to save that andesite. Can't keep up, though. Yeah, definitely not. Hmm, we're going to need to upgrade those or find a different solution for our pipes. Or we could just have this going into our network. Look at that, we already got more iron. This is amazing. Okay, so I was looking at what we can use the shears in, and it looks like we're only going to be able to use the Animal Ranger from Industrial Foregoing. Now, what I'm thinking is, is because it needs plastic, obviously we're gonna have to get into industrial foregoing. So what I'm gonna need is a fluid extractor, probably gonna need to put three down. Then I'm gonna need those piped into a latex processing unit. And then we will be able to get the rubber and be able to throw that into a furnace. And then we will have our animal rancher. Check this out. Look at this. We have it, guys. We've got it. I went ahead and just, we have it set up over here. We're still producing lots of latex. I'm very happy about that. Let's get a quick nap. And we can go test this bad boy out. Now, I do want to go ahead and grab some wheat, hopefully. Yep, we got some wheat here. I'm also going to go ahead and grab some fences so we can hopefully convince wink wink nudge nudge some of the wildlife to come back with us all right so we've captured our first victim now we will name this guy after the person who comments the funniest dad joke they have the person who has the funniest dad joke we will name the sheep after you because we won't kill him so there you go comments comment away one with the most likes wins Okay, so we got our second pig here. Now, the the joke, the fart joke with the most likes, we'll get to name the brown pig after them. So, yeah, you guys get crack a -lack and That baby doesn't count. All right, guys, so that's going to wrap up the episode for today. Next episode, guys, we're going to be working on some refined storage, and I hope you guys do enjoy that. Now, while you guys are here, uh, I want to go ahead and just test out this thingamabobber doohickey. Give me a second. All right, so we're going to shear one of these sheepums here. And actually, we're going to shear both of them and make sure that they both can be processed by this thing because I want to go ahead and get this set up so that the sheep will get sheared by our uh, create mod. And eventually, we can make like a cool factory out of it. Uh, so if we go ahead and toss this in here... Yep, that grinds it up. Okay, it's done. We get string out. Do we just get string? Okay, so it seems to be one to one here. Now, what about brown wool? 
Okay, that seems to be done. We got two strength. Okay, so it's one to one. So every time we get one wool, we get one strength. Not the best, but it is a way to get string that we didn't have before. Now we have it kind of automated, but not really. We can, we can set that up later. But guys, that's going to wrap up the episode for today. If you did enjoy the video, please make sure to hit that like button. And as always, don't forget to subscribe. But guys, this has been Super Turtle, and I hope you enjoyed today's episode. It has been fun. I will see you all in the next one. Take care. Bye-bye.